Good morning, year one. How are you all? How is everything? I hope everything is okay. Welcome to our and we are going to talk about the materials and their properties. So let's start. What does the material mean? The materials are what the things are made from. So everything around us is made from the materials and the thing is called object. Okay, to so look at this picture. Can you name some different objects here? Yes. Scissors, pencil, pen, lamp, backpack, clock, chair, desk, razor, paper clip, and the board. There is some markers. They all called objects. Okay. Made from materials. Okay, look at this door. This door it's made from wood and I can get the wood from the tree. This is what it's the key. I can open the door with it and it's made from metal. It's made from metal. Okay, this is shirt. It's fabric material and it's made from cotton and I can bring the cotton from the cotton plant. This is glass. Okay, this is eraser. It's made from rubber and I get it from the rubber tree. This is plastic bottle and it, the material is plastic. Okay guys, we can use our senses to know what this material is. So I'm going to explore and find out more about these different materials. Describe what these things look like. Look at this picture and try to observe it, to look and know the difference between them. Okay, so can you do it? I want you to answer this question. What do you think these things feel like? So feel, I'm going to use my sense of touch. Yes, so I'm going to use the scan to touch the object and know the difference between them right between the nail and the brick between the pencil and the scarf between uh, the ball so these objects okay I'm also I can look at these things and what's look like what's the sound like if you tap on them if I tap on the calculator, it makes a sound. If I tap on the can, it makes a sound. If I tap on the plastic bottle, it makes different sound. So because they are different materials. Okay, so what do you think these things smell like? Jelly and the book? Yes, it smells different, of course. Try it at home? Yes, it smells different. So I'm going to use my senses to explore the materials okay there are many different type of materials materials have different properties so i'm going to look to the color how it's look how it's feel when i touch it i'm going to use my senses to explore and know the materials properties by explore and describe by what explore and describe some materials are hard, like this rock. Some are soft, like this cotton. Some are shiny, like this ring. And some are dull, like this piece of wood. And some is smooth, like this baby. He's so cute. When I touch it, I found his skin is so smooth. And like this, it's so rough. Look at the picture, it's so rough. I can hurt my hand with it. Now, look at this picture. This man is holding a bag and all the thing inside it, it fall down. Why? What do you think? Why do you think this is happening? Because what, this material is so strong? No, this is so weak. So, this material is so weak that it make the object inside it fall down because 
it's light materials? No, because they are they were so heavy on the plastic bag. So this is what the strong and the weak properties of materials. Heavy and light, it's also properties of here we can use different materials in different way based on their properties. It's raining but this clever boy he's so cute he's wearing a rain coat and a rain boot why he does it why he did this because he do not want his clothes to be wet so he need a material that do not let the water pass or go through them right and these materials are called waterproof material they are called waterproof materials like this umbrella also okay so who spilled this water who did this okay so I'm going to use this tissue to take the water right so suck up the water so this is called absorbent materials so the material that I can use it to absorb or suck up the water it's called absorbent materials are called what absorbent materials okay so also this towel i can use it to dry my hand because it's absorb the water can i dry my hand with the plastic bag can this happen of course not okay so this is rubber and this is elastic band and i make a heart with it okay so this material is bendy okay and i can stretch it i can stretch it with my hands okay because it's a flexible materials and it's bendy it's a flexible and what this shirt also have some properties who can tell me yes it's soft material bendy mm, how it's bendy because i can wear it so it can fit it can fit on my body okay and it's absorbent yes if someone is the water on me i'm going to be wet so and flexible also okay so this glass look at this picture this lady she's wearing a sunglasses right so can she wear a sunglasses made from metal or wood can this happen no because she need to see through it right she needs can i make the window made of glass or wood of course i want to make it made of glass because i wanted to so i want it i want to see through it okay thank you guys i wish you have a nice day and good evening.